Pitched It rules are a powerful tool to customize your shipping experience and improve automation. In this video, we'll cover what rules are, how they can benefit your business, and see a quick demonstration of how they work. Simply put, rules control the automation in your Pitched It shipping processes. You create your own rules from templates provided by PasteJet, and those rules that you create can change how automation works and instantly reconfigure how the PasteJet application is set up. If that sounds complicated, don't worry. We've also provided a best practice library that makes setup very easy. Before we take a look at the demonstration, let's talk for a second about benefits. First, rules can help your team make fewer mistakes by setting established automated processes with fewer decisions. The use of rules also makes compliance easier by automating the follow-through that's specific to your business, whether it's carrier rules or customer needs. And with PageDet rules, you can do it yourself, saving time and money, you don't need to contact support, you don't need to work with professional services. How's it work? Well, let's take a closer look at a demonstration. We'll start here in PageDet under Setup, Shipment Rules, and bring up the rules I already have installed and configured. Here we can click the plus icon to bring up the library of best practice rule templates. There are many templates available, so type ahead searching allows me to type in, for example, here hold and see rules that are available to manage hold processes. I can also type in carrier if I want to look for rules involving rate shopping, pricing, or other needs. Each template shown here has a name and a description, along with a date when it was last updated, and an indicator that tells you if you've used it to create a rule yourself already. On the main shipment rules display, you can see all of the rules you've previously installed and configured. You give them your own name. There's an indicator of whether an update is available, perhaps with new features, and a convenient slider to make rules active or inactive. The team at PageDead is rapidly expanding the library of templates that are available. So one of the features we've added here is a custom rule template option. So if we work with your team and perhaps there's a template we haven't created yet, we could create one just for you, for your environment while we evaluate uh, putting it in the standard library for all users. Let's take a look at how easy it is to install and create your own rules. So I'll type in add tag, click install to begin to configure my rule. This rule allows me to attach a tag to a shipment based on conditions in that shipment. Here you can see tags for free shipping, back orders, Amazon orders, lots of ways to categorize shipments to tighten up my automation. To create my tag, I want to look at a particular shipment field and identify a value in that field. So I hit the drop down for shipment level field, and I can find standard fields, custom fields, any data element in the shipment that I want to use to create that tag. Since this is a conditional activity, I can identify whether the value in the field should be equal to, greater than, or any other variety of conditions to create my tag. The last part of the rule setup is simply entering a value to match against my expression. Hit save, and that's all there is to set this up. Well, that's all the time we have for this quick demonstration, but hopefully you can see that shipment rules can help you customize your shipping experience to reduce your time and effort, improve automation, make it easier to comply with many different types of shipping rules, and save time and money while you control and manage your own shipping experience. Reach out to PaceJet to learn more.